Hello, folks, and we have a different type of workbench uh, sort of episode this week. The office bench. Yes, the office bench. You'll see it in just a second. I'll back up and you'll get to see it. We've experimented on this one a little bit, so we're going to have a little fun with this episode today. But we are here with Tarek. We're not technically talking about lights today, but we are talking about electrical solutions that we can provide for office spaces, homes, uh, that sort of thing. So with that, right. I'm going to let you part take it away. Part of the solutions. So... Today we have pop-ups, pop-ups which can go in your kitchen countertops, which can go in your office, into your desks. Hell, you could put them in your bedroom if you wanted to, or even in an RV. And today we're going to go over three different pop-ups with varying technology. So, if you want to come over here to the side, McHugh, what is a pop-up? Basically, it's exactly what it looks like. It is a pop-up for chargers. Now, these three here, you can see them, they're all... USB based. Now, the cool thing with these is A, they're only about an inch, inch and a half wide. This one here has two plugs. This one here has a single plug, but uses Qualcomm rapid technology, if you can see it right here. And then this one's probably my favorite one. Not only is this IP54, based on the little sign you see on top, it has wireless charging. So we put our phone on. And there we go, we're charging. Now, you guys see these two pieces over here. They're both the same, so come on over to the other side. And these are beautiful for office, but mainly for kitchen countertops. So what we do is we just pull it up. You have your USB chargers, you have your standard chargers. Now these come with various options, so we can add in uh, Bluetooth uh, sound around, uh, sorry, Bluetooth sound systems. We can add in um, Wi-Fi as needed. Um, and by Wi-Fi, it's actually cool because it actually acts as um, an extender. But that is, uh, we're still playing around with that a bit to get the right, the right feel for it. When you want it, you just put it down to the level you need, wires in, and then you have the small open slot here on the side. And that allows your wires to come if you're just charging your phones. Now this one is the same as this one, but why is one up and the other one's not? Because, guys, make sure you get the right sized hole cutter. Otherwise, you end up with a hole which is a bit too damn big. Now we can get away with it over here for funs and giggles, but you know, you don't want to make that mistake if you're doing it yourself at home. The second thing and most more important thing is you gotta be safe because even if you get the right piece of equipment, if you go through a pre existing hole or you don't use a safer technique, and I suggest there's lots of videos on YouTube about how to drill properly. And if we had listened to our own advice, we wouldn't be in the situation. You end up with something like this. <laughs> and let me tell you, the wife will not be happy. The company owner will not be happy. And you might just have to buy something new to make up with it. So <laughs> that is our workbench today. And <clears throat> this is going to be the only workbench for the week. Uh, if you're interested in any of these products, please drop us a yeah, line. Small, quick pop-ups. Nothing, you know, crazy about it. But they are here. They are available. And just one of the solutions that we provide here at Southern Lighting. And we do hope that everybody out there has a happy Thanksgiving. Absolutely. Mr. Tarek here will be have a safe. Yes. Thanksgiving. Have, have a safe Thanksgiving uh, if you choose to enjoy it with others. And we will be back next week with a full workbench, a three episode workbench, as well Absolutely. as a podcast. So we will see you guys next week. Have a great holiday. Take care.